everyone. Um, thanks for coming. Uh, my name is Tanika. Uh, I'm a junior at PCTA. And um, uh, I'm also a member of Youth Pride Inc. and also the part of the Student Union. And it is my opinion, along with many other students across the nation, that police aren't really our friends. I believe we need to replace cops in our schools with more counselors. Many, um, how many meltdowns do you, do kids have to? I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm kind of nervous. All right, I, I believe we need to replace cops in our schools with more counselors. Yes. How many meltdowns do kids have to go through in Providence? Decides um, before Providence decides to invest in mental health support for us. Yes. Woo! Other than the fact that cops are a negative factor, we have we have nurses who aren't even there full time. If one were to be angry, upset, or practically ill, there is no support for us. We only get penalized. In Providence, there are several police officers paid by the school districts patrolling the hallways. This window. Anyway, <laughs> some students have experienced getting handcuffed for no reason but expressing their rights. We don't make us feel, um, we don't deserve the environment that criminalizes us and make us feel like we are prisoners. Article 11 of the Student Bill of Rights states that students have the right to feel safe on school's campus, having the access to full-time student support staff like nurses and more counselors, and the learning environment for free, for free from police officers and the immigration and, and custom enforcement presence. The Student Bill of Rights isn't just a wish list or an unrealistic dream. It is something that should be taken seriously because we fight. We will fight until we deserve what, what we. Uh, we. Yes. Yeah, we. Can I get an amen? Amen. Yes. 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 Okay. Sorry. Um, Don't be sorry, girl. <laughs> we will fight for these rights until we get an education with dignity we deserve. We hope that our teachers, principals, district in this city is listening. Thank you, y'all.